retraction. Oh, there's a shin. Oh, there's a shin. What's up guys, Tuesday morning, just off, in fact, tell a lie, it's Tuesday afternoon, it's actually 20 to 2. Um, I skipped cardio this morning, I'm going to do it tonight when I get in, um, after work. Um, we have something to eat and then go to the gym later, before I go to bed basically. Um, but I'm just off the train back, so I'm going to take you through my pre-workout setup. Coffee, raise. Um, I have ordered some caffeine and some beta alanine, so I'm going to mix that in with my raise and basically make um, a full pre-workout. That should be coming tomorrow. I've got my True Performance Ripped tablets that I take four before a workout. I've started taking them since Friday, I think it was, or maybe Thursday. I've got my two-stage release CLA tablets, which I'd usually take CLA before a meal, but it suggests on here for some reason to take them before a workout, so that's what I'm doing. I've got this little butte. As it's Easter, as you can imagine, I got a bit of chocolate, but um, as I said in my video yesterday, I started adding just a little bit of chocolate either before a workout, after a cardio workout, just for a little spike, nothing too crazy, but you have no idea how hard it is to just eat one of these this is a mini as you can see compared to my thumb it's very minute and as soon as I've got a taste for this all I want to do is have another six and my intra workout skills so I'm have a bit of energy so if you have a bit of a better workout today than I did yesterday as I say I was lacking a bit in energy um, towards the middle of the workout but it didn't let it stop me. I've got a goal, stick to it, trained hard, and slept well last night. So I'll try and get some footage for you guys this time. Just going to go back to David Lloyd, um, and hopefully it won't be as busy so we can get some footage. See you at the gym. What's up, guys? So unfortunately, we forgot to film our first exercise, which was bent over rows. Um, we built up to our maxes, like about 100, 120 kilos, and then in templates and then we just done a drop set so as many as we can on 120 take two tens off either side then as many as we can two tens all the way down to 40 kilos here you can see me doing some pause um, pulls or dead pulls so we basically go all the way down take the tension off and then hit the pull up for a set of 10 we done two sets of 10 on the pause pulls then we done just regular wide grip pull ups keeping tension on for two sets of 10 and then we moved into chins, which is the underarm grip, hitting a bit more bicep uh, for two sets of ten as well, even though my buddy, my workout buddy, forgot to film the first two reps. Um, but I promise you, I did do ten. Um, then moved on to a superset cable pulleys with cable pull downs, um, or straight arm pull downs. Here we've done four sets of fifteen on both exercises. Um, I like to have a little bit of movement rather than keeping it strict because then I can hit my lower lats as well as just my upper lats and traps. Um, the big boys back in the day used to do that so um, I'm going to stick with what they used to do. Here are some cable rope pull downs, one of my favourite exercises again for really hitting the lats, helping build some width. Quite happy with my condition at the moment. Um, about five and a half weeks out and feeling pretty lean so hopefully well I will be definitely bringing better condition this year to body power but um but yeah hopefully I can keep and maintain as much size as possible within the next five weeks then moves on to five sets of 20 lap pull downs this is just nice and light and all we was doing was partials so kind of going up to a um, keeping tension on the lats and then coming down to the top of the chest um, at no point can you lock out um, and get full stretch to basically take tension off so you just do 20, 20 reps, 5 sets one in one out then moved on to something slightly different these um, are kind of like incline pulls for the top of your back, for your traps, for your rear delts don't do many of these but um, it actually hurt in the morning it hurt the next day so um, I think I'll probably include a bit more of this into um, my back routine 
but we superset these with inclined bicep curls as well which again takes out the swing um, hitting I think for sets of 10 to 15 reps just really not too too heavy on the counting it's just a case of making sure you're going until it hurts <laughs> so as you can probably tell guys most of my workouts now are just high volume supersets drop sets things like that um, I do still go heavy at the beginning of the week towards the end of the week I tend to go um, a little bit lighter then we finish off our back routine with some biceps and shrugs superset uh, so cable bicep curls with a straight bar uh, for a set of 20 and then I've done five I mean I call them Steve Cook curls but um, it's just where you drag the bar up to your chest moving your elbow back a little bit stronger there so I managed to get another five five reps out move straight over into dumbbell shrugs by this point grip was absolutely absolutely mutilated so it was actually probably harder holding on to the dumbbells than it was actually shrugging hence why we didn't go too heavy so we went for reps again instead I think about 20 reps here hope you enjoyed the video guys and I'll leave you with some raw footage from gymnastics day um, which was the following day uh, where we hit some flips some pummel horse and some rings so give me a quick brief overview of my day so far it's Wednesday um, it's about half past one so far today I've got up a, uh, it's a no carb day today because I've got my Fit Factor casting on Saturday so like I said earlier on in the week I'm doing like a mini carb deeply followed by a carb load um, just to try and tighten up and fill out a little bit before the casting you don't have to be stage ready so obviously I mean I've still got five weeks uh, till I step on stage feeling pretty good but I kind of want to go there um, with pretty reasonable condition looking quite full and um, try and uh, make sure that my uh, my competition brings their A game as well so um, so I'm just on my way to work and this morning I had my mince and eggs I didn't have any beans, I didn't have any porridge, I just had mince and eggs um, I've cooked up some chicken and veg, that's going to be my second meal later on today um, just finished a leg workout, you are going to see me doing some gymnastics tonight, I'm going to take you with me I'm going to hit the uh, gymnastics, hopefully get some flips and get some footage of me on the rings so, um, so yeah guys, I'll see you at the gym tonight Okay, so just finished gymnastics. Um, it's quite nice to be able to take you guys in there with me. Hopefully, you enjoyed that as much as I did. That was um, eight weeks, probably eight weeks, maybe seven weeks since we last went. So um, I definitely, definitely felt that. My, um, I, I was definitely a bit stronger, but my shoulders, my traps, my triceps um, got hammered during that session. But um, it was a lot of fun. So um, I'll definitely be going again now on the regular. Five and a half weeks out then. Currently depleted. 
start my carb load tomorrow tomorrow evening I'm absolutely knackered from gymnastics but um, I'm just going to get my fish I've gone for 400 grams a day because I'm obviously low carb so and yeah I'll see you guys in the morning <laughs>